But anyway, what happened was I was contacted by a label, uh, Frontiers, and they wanted to do like a super group thing, and uh, they had me in mind for the singer, which I thought was kind of crazy, but... I'll be the drummer! <laughs> <laughs> Is your name Brian Tishy? Fuck yeah! <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> so they they suggested doing like a super group thing. They wanted me to sing, and they um, one thing led to another. And he suggested a guy by the name of John Levin. You guys know who John Levin is? Yeah. John plays for Dawkins. Dawkins. John's a great player, killer player. Plays a lot like George, and just really, really great, great stylist, man. And, uh, but they suggested John, and I just thought, well. If you're trying to merge that striper and that docket thing, you know, why don't we go to the original guy? Yeah. Yeah. Serafino agreed and said, do you know, do you know George? You know, I said, yeah, I do. So I reached out to George. George was in from second one. And uh, I suggested Brian Tishy, who played for Foreigner and White Snake, and also James Lomenzo, who played for White Lion. We toured together back in 1988, 89. And he's gone on to play with Megadeth and uh, David Lee Roth. He's now with John Fogarty, just a jack of all trades, amazing player. So we got a killer rhythm section, and we got the one and only Mr. George Lynch, and then we got that dynasty young metal dude, Michael Sweet on vocals. And I'll tell you what, man, it's pretty cool. It's a cool project, it's a cool album. We got our second album coming out November 10th. It's called Unified. And uh, the imagery on that album and the lyric of that song Unified is is basically trying to portray how we are as a world kind of falling apart in many ways. You know, we're not uh, we're certainly divided to say the least. And uh, it it would be great to see and, and I already see in many ways how we can be unified. And when we come together, and we are unified. We do great things. You know, and it's just an incredible thing to see the witness and to be a part of. So that's what the song is. It's, it's, again, it always comes back to, I try to lay things out there and then try to encourage people through that. But there's always hope. Never, ever let go of the fact that there's always hope. I don't care how dark it is. I don't care how you feel or you think there's no hope whatsoever. There's always hope, man. And the day always turns around. You know? So uh, that's the message of Unified. So check it out. I hope you guys dig it. Musically speaking, I didn't tell you what it's like. It's, it's kind of like, uh, if you like uh, country and polka, you're going to dig this out right now. You're going to love it. There you go. Okay, I promise you. So I'm going to try a song, not from Unified, but from Sweet Lynch, the first album. Okay? Yeah. It's called Lonely to Rise, and this song is called Dying Rose, all right? Good song. Again, my interpretation. Record yourself and then have it play for you, you know? It's the world we live in. 